I'm Pastor John, and thank you for coming to the YouTube clips. So glad that you can join me. Now, we're going to have a lot of fun, because some of you have misread me. You think that I'm this old, angry guy trying to take out the preachers. You may even think that I'm jealous. Jealous? Well, you found me out. I'm jealous for God. I believe that God speaks to us through one medium. This word right here, the book. The book of books. I also believe that we've been deceived over the past 30 and 40 years by so-called bishops that we've placed in charge of our lives. We've given our money, our homes, sometimes our bodies for sex, and millions and millions of dollars, and have made them millionaires, and we still have no satisfaction. What can we do about it as the church? That's why you've come to this YouTube clip. If you go to my site, and it's on the screen right now, it's my name, www.johnecoleman.org. That website, and along with other attending websites, 50 Righteous, and other good websites that are linked to mine, you will learn that there's a litany of men that are ready to speak the truth for you. But you know what you have to do? You have to be willing enough to say, you know what, John, you're right. I've been taken advantage of. You will hear me mention men's names like Noel Jones, Creflo Dollar, T.D. Jakes, and then I'll even go over to the white side of the world and uh, talk about people on TBM. I call names because it's important to do that. In this book, I see the Bible men doing the same thing. Now, your role in this association that we have. I want you to come to the clips, and I want you to know that I'd never lie to you. Secondarily, I'm not trying to build up my ministry, whatever that means. What I have to do is to inform you that the church has been taken over by dialectic pirates, and especially in the community that I live in, the African American community. Now, what we have facing us today are a bunch of men. They are trained in the dialectic. They are trained in knowing how to get exactly what they want from you. Your money, your lives. As you come to these particular clips on YouTube, you will see certain students of mine sitting in the classroom studying theology. Where did I teach them? Right out of my home. This studio that this is being filmed in is in my home. My whole home is nothing but a gigantic studio to train students in the Word of God because we are truly living in the last days. You will experience no shenanigans. You will experience no uh, hyperbole. You will just experience doctrine. Doctrine. There's a particular clip that Fred Price says, and we filmed him when we were in Jack Hayford's church, where Fred Price says, Doctrine? Doctrine is what screwed up the church in the first place. I want to tell you people something. Doctrine is what frees us. So I want you to be at ease when you come and view these YouTube clips. I want you to know that I have but one motive, and that is to give you the Word of God. Uh, I'm kind of apprehensive about doing television and clips like this, because when a pastor does it and he has a charisma, he builds up a certain following. I'm not trying to get a bunch of people to follow me. If you know PJ, he doesn't need a crowd to follow him. But what I need you to do is to know Jesus Christ for yourself. I need you to study the Word of God and to know the doctrine of the Scriptures. And then what I need you to do is to call a spade a spade. When you run into a preacher that's a pimp, don't be afraid to call him one. When they try to use that old cliche, touch not the Lord's anointed, you've got to get into the habit of saying, my brother, my sister, God forbid a female pimp, you have never been appointed. I want to thank you for coming to this section, watching these clips, and I'm looking forward to spending more time with you. Until we meet again, stay into the Word.